Hi everybody, how are you? It's Paula from Paula's Picks. Glad to see you guys again. Glad you're watching. If you haven't hit the subscribe button, please do. Like, share, tell everybody about it. And uh, we went to Dollar Tree today, me and my son, so I'll just jump right in. I did pretty good. Um, I only spent $50, so that was pretty good. Usually me and my son kind of go a little overboard sometimes. So they have a ton of their calendars out. So my son got this. He likes this. He's going to put this one on his wall. Probably with those little thumbtacks that I showed you from the Rite Aid um, haul that we just did that I just uploaded. So if you didn't see that, look at that one first. And then he got this one. It's all beaches and tropical getaways. And it's a two-pack. It comes with a smaller calendar that sunsets and the bigger one that's all tropical. And then here's all the pictures. So he got those two. He got these letters. He likes these letters like he's got before. He got them in the red this time. And they had a new one out and it's it's borders and it has six borders on it. And we thought it was bubbles. It looks like bubbles to us, but it's borders going this way. So he got those. He really liked it. Then he picked up soda pop scented bubbles. Cause this is the dollar, same Dollar Tree that's right down the road from me that I showed you when I did the other one that still has, now they're down to one row of summer stuff. Now they've got two rows of Halloween out, two rows of fall stuff out, and one row they still have that summer that they still have two complete, you know, two complete rows that still has all this stuff. So he got these, thought they were cute. He picked up a bottle of Mod Podge. I don't know. I guess he's going to Mod Podge with me. I don't know. I finally found all those succulents that everybody was hauling. <coughs> and I got this one. It's like a... <coughs> what? It's got like mauve and, and like kind of orangish. And, but I picked that one up. It's the only one I liked. And I really don't like this container colors. I'm thinking about painting it or adding some twine or something or a little fall decal. I don't know. Something. It just seems like it's missing something to me. Then they had a ton of these. They just put them out. They still had the plastic on them. These stainless steel bowls. So I got two of them. I don't know about you guys, but this year we have a really bad ant problem. So I've been getting after everybody in the house to be sure and pick up their when they make something to eat pick up everything and throw it away so if it's all in the trash the ants all go to the trash if we feed our dogs they go after our dog's bowl of food so i got this little one for him so that we just put the right amount of food that he'll eat as soon as he eats we pick it up wash it out wipe it out whatever because the ants this year are just horrible so we got that box then, I've only seen like two people haul these, and I watch, if you see all the people I've subscribed to, I've subscribed to quite a few. So, I've only seen two people haul these so far. So, and they've all been complaining that they're missing one of the sizes or something like that. But, I got every single size that they had of these I guess you call them paper mache boxes. They say autumn and and stuff. So there's the smallest one. It says pumpkin patch. And in my Dollar Tree down here, they had three sets of these. So I got two sets. So I just left one set for somebody. And then here's the next size up. And it's got sunflowers, pumpkins, and it's green and yellow. And it says thankful. So I got two of those. And then the next size up says Fall Harvest. And I got two of those. And it's green inside. It looks blue on the screen, but it's green inside. So I got two of those. 
And then I got two of the largest ones that say autumn. And it's got pumpkins all inside. And it says harvest in the lid. And I like these because I like the Dollar Tree because every season they have some kind of boxes. They have boxes for Halloween. I really don't do Halloween because um, my kids, they love Christmas because they're autistic. And they love Christmas. And so the money that I would have spent on a Halloween costume for them, we take that money and we buy them extra stuff for Christmas. So that makes them happy. They like that because they like the decorations, they like um, the candy, they like everything about Christmas. So we just spend it on that. Then um, my son picked up this mix of the sour mix. He likes all that sour stuff. Him and my son do so. My other son. So he got that. Those are yours. Then I finally, after watching, whoops, I think I broke something. After watching um, Bonnie from Bon Bon's Halls all the time get these and see how much her, her husband, her daughter love them, and Jody from Jody's Craft Room getting these, I looked at six different Dollar Trees. Could never find them. I love the Nor products because I make um, the vegetable Nor thing is what I make spinach dip out of. So I love the Nor products. So I finally found these. So I got two of the cheddar broccoli and I got two of the chicken flavor. So now I'll tell you why I never found these before. It's because at my Dollar Tree, well, at least the one down the road, they don't have them at eye level. These were the chicken, the chicken flavor and the chicken broccoli were all on the highest shelf they could be on in the, in the, I guess you want to call them not wooden, but you know, the cardboard boxes that they come in, but they're cut out and stuff. So you, you, you can see them like this, but they're way up on the high shelf. Who's looking that high up? For rice mixes. I'm not. So I told that lady, how come you guys don't bring those down for us? She goes, well, we usually have a spot. But they usually don't last that long. People see them and they just grab them. So I was like, okay. But I'm sure a lot more people would buy them if they could see them. Then they had a whole bunch of these. I got a um, clear one. It's glass. It's a little cutting board. But the reason I got this, I really need a bigger one that's square is because um, I need it because I'm going to be getting a, a, a burning tool to burn um, um, burlap deco mesh. So I need I need the glass to burn it on. I can't burn it on wood because it's a wood, a wood tool for wood carving like stuff so it burns. Um, so I can't do it so I have to do it on here so I won't burn my table or anything else. But they had like three or four of these. And they had different sayings on, but I, I just need it for that. So I just got a plain one. But so if anybody wants a glass little cutting board, that's perfect. Then I got two of these. One of them's missing the wire. This one has it. This one doesn't. But I got these. They're in green. So I'm going to get some little holders and put in here some little candles. And I might take this off. Um, and just put some little leaves, tie with the leaves with um, twine or something around the tops. Um, I don't know. Or I might leave it on, hang one, do something else with the other. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Then they finally put out the salt and pepper shakers. So they had these, some squirrels, and I think some pumpkins. So I got the owls. I really liked them. They're cute. I might get the other two. And give them away when I have Thanksgiving dinner um, here at my house. I don't know. I'm not sure yet. I'm kind of trying to get my husband to go to my in-laws this year for Thanksgiving. Since my mom and daughter moved to Florida. I, I don't know. Just depends on my work schedule. And I'm just, I don't know. I just don't really want to cook this year. So just trying to make a couple of things and go somewhere else. But we'll see. Then I was so happy, so, so happy. I found my green pumpkin I've been looking for. So I was happy about that. So this one I can put with my blue one. So 
happy about that. And then I found another one that's like a cream color but a little bit darker. And then it just has the orange in the creases of the pumpkin. And it's got the leaf on there and I like the stem so I got this one. I got it because it looked different. It was the last green one they had and the last one that they had like this. Then I got some socks. I got some socks. I did. I was all happy to find some more socks. I got for the little, they're for little boys. So anybody that's got a little boy that wants these socks, let me know. It's a three pack. It's got pizzas. They're black and then they're striped because it's for a little boy. It's for kids five to nine. My kids don't have that small of a foot. So somebody wants these, let me know. Then I got these with the hamburgers on. They're women's five to nine. They got the hamburgers and they got the stripes. I like those. I picked those up. I think I've already got some of those. I'm not sure though. And then I got two pairs of these, two sets, because I'm going to send one to my friend in Oregon. And it's got tacos. And then the other pair is green and gray, which I love because I love that color. So it's the same way with this one. And then I picked this up for somebody else to give to them, even though I like watermelons too. I think they're great. This was the last one they had. And at this Dollar Tree right down the street, they have a really tiny section of socks. And it's on one of the aisles. The Dollar Tree that I go to that's off at 8 Mile in Stockton, you walk in the front door and to the left, and they've got a whole wall of socks. And it's great. They have all kinds. But um, not this one. This one just has a little tiny section, and you're lucky if you find what you're looking for. So there's the watermelon, and here's the stripes. So that's cute. I'm going to videotape down to this um, Dollar Tree one day, because they've got boxes everywhere, and it's just horrible. It just looks so trashed. Then I was super excited again, because I finally found... Some stuff I wanted. I've been looking for. They were on my list. So, and they only had one box. And it's all the little corn things. I found them. And I found them in all different colors. Here's an orange one, but it has like some browns in it. Here's an orange with yellow. Then I found this one that's pure yellow. And then these. So, I got an idea from something because I saw some of the fairy lights at Dollar Tree too. So I got an idea today. So I'm hoping that it pans out and I'm going to try it. And if it does and it works, then I'll show it to you guys and then I'll show you the end result. So let me know if you want to see that because I think it's kind of exciting. So I think I picked up two, four, I picked up six of these. And then I was looking for this one sign and I found it. Yeah, they I'm had it mom. with the, um, with the old bicycle and I like it that it's the the pumpkin shape and I like the little leaf up here so I like this I found this and I, re I really like this sign so I was glad to find that and we have a ton of that kind of stuff up, up front of our house so I'll have to tape that one time put it in the box put that in the box yeah. so I'll have to tape that sometime and show you then they had a huge box of pumpkins the little felt pumpkins and I looked in the box and there was only three left and four there was only four left this is the only white one they had left this is not the color I wanted remember I got the darker like the brownish cream color last time I wanted the lighter one that was in between the white and the light brown the, the champagne color can't find it so I got that so I'm gonna do something with it got that one then I went down the aisle and they had these um, Main Street Wall Creations Pill and Stick Removable Won't Harm Walls. They had this, this says Smile and it's a whale. So I got that because if you remember in my 99 cent haul, I got those plaques that are square or rectangular. So I want to do some DIYs with those. And then I got this one that says Love and it's got the hearts. So I want to do something with those. 
And then I got these two picks, these two scarecrows. So I'm going to do something with these. Maybe a floral arrangement, put one in and give away, and then another floral arrangement and give to somebody else. I don't know. We'll see. If I go somewhere for Thanksgiving, I'll make up one and take with me. Then because I said that they had a ton of spring and the summer stuff still, they had these in the barbecue at the end of a, of a aisle, and they're really thick. I know Jennifer from Jennifer uh, Moen 5, I know she doesn't like these kind of mitts at the dollar store because she says they're not thick enough, but these, let me tell you, are thick. They're really thick. So, I, and you can see, you can see they're thicker than the normal ones they have. And it has the anti-glare thing on the back here. And they look like they're made pretty good. But these ones were not where the regular ones were. They were by all the barbecue stuff. And they have the silver on the back. So that was, I like those. So I got those. <laughs> then there's two, um, I got two birds. They were putting brand new birds out. So I got the yellow bird and I got the red bird. So I like the cardinal. It's really pretty. I'm going to use those. Then they had some more stickers they had just put out. So I got these. They're all green butterflies. See, and they're kind of puffy. They kind of stick out. So I really like those. Then I got, I did get something from the Halloween part. I got some more googly eyes. But these ones are like blue, purple, orange, green. So I like those. I'm going to make some of those little pom-poms and put the different colored eyes on them. So I like those. We got this for my son because he likes Thomas. It's a play thing. The little play pack things. They only had one Thomas couldn't find anymore. They had about three or four of the fabrics. So I got these. Their stars were red and white, and then the background's white. I mean, they're red and blue, and the background's white. Said that backwards. And then I finally I was super excited to find these. Finally found the pumpkin um, wreath things. So I'm definitely doing a DIY with this. Um, hopefully it turns out the way I have it in my head. I'm going to draw it out first. but So I did that. Got those. I'm going to do that. Then I found these, and they were just like in a weird area. They're coloring clear stamps by Hampton Art, and they're stamps. It says to peel clear stamp from acetate sheet and position on a clear block. Ink stamp line with desired imprint location by viewing through clear block make impression. I've never seen these before. The dollar store. So they're all stamps. This big one's a stamp, that one's a stamp, and all these are stamps. And there was two sets, and they're both different. So I thought that was neat. I really like them. So that was me and my son's Dollar Tree haul today. And then the other day we went grocery shopping at Rayleigh's, and before we left the store, you'll never guess what I bought. I bought some more napkins and they said they were only 50 cents it says gone fishing shows the fish and the fishing pole and here's the campfire so i thought those were cute so i got those so in about five minutes i'll be uploading my next one which will be my hobby lobby big haul so stay tuned thank you for watching please subscribe share and like thank you so much